Hello everyone, welcome back to another informative video. As you can see, I have two sets of seedlings here. One set that I have planted in peat moss, and some people will even plant their seeds or set their seeds in, in soil. And I have another set right here that I have um, planted in perlite. Now, of course, as you know, I have in my garden I have the hydroponic setup where I use perlite as a growing medium, and I have the fabric container where I where I have a, a, a mixture, a soil mixture. Hence, I have to use two different mediums to set my seedlings. But what you find is these they basically have soil particles, or they basically have some sort of sediment that you don't want to get into your hydroponic system, right? So what I'm going to show you is how to properly remove the, the growing medium from the, the roots so that you can either transfer it to, to a perlite medium or you can basically go ahead and plant it directly into the perlite in the bucket, right? If the plant is big enough, such as something like this, this one is big enough, right? So if this one was basically planted in peat moss or soil, when I remove the, the, the soil particles or the peat moss particle from the roots, I would basically just plant it directly into the, into the five gallon um, bucket with the perlite instead of transferring it to, to, a, to a pot, to a pot like, to a container like, like this to get bigger, right? So basically, so what you will need is you'll need a container with some, with some water, right? Put that one side. Then I'm going to select, I'm going to select a, a plant that I'm going to use. Right, so this is what the, the roots look like. Right? So it has good amount of root development. So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to just dip the, the root ball into the water, right? And just gently agitate it right it's gently ag agitated right so this is basically um filled with with the peat mass particle or sediment so i'm going to throw this away right then i'm going to add some more some some more water right and then i'm going to just re repeat the process right so as you can see, um, all the roots are intact, right? So what I'm going to do now is I'm going to get a, a, a pot, right? And I'm going to fill it with, well, half it with some perlite, right? Like that, right? And then I'm going to put my my plant to sit exactly where I want it, right? And then I'm going to fill it now with perlite, right? Just like this, right? When I'm done now, I'll just water it, right? So here it is, so I'm just going to add some water to it, to the perlite, just to, for the perlite to absorb some moisture and to keep the roots hydrated, right? It is done, and this one, I had done this one yesterday, right? And as you can see, the same thing I did, and as you can see, this is the outcome, right? This is the outcome. So if you have any questions, any comments, put them in the comments area. Right? And I'll see you again in another video. Bye-bye.